Well, my mom's name was Boots. It was a nickname that she got when she was uh, real young. She used to wear these high-top English boots to school all the time, and uh, and so they gave her that nickname. She had that nickname her whole life. From the time she was eight years old, she used to ride horses for my granddad. And if any, if an eight-year-old can ride a horse, anybody can ride it. And that was the that was the thinking behind that. When we moved to Texas, we started getting horses, and people would ask Mom all the time, how much does a horse really cost? And she'd give them this long story about how much a horse cost, and, and I thought it might make a nice little song, so it's called, How Much Does a Horse Cost? Well, tell me, Boots, how much does a horse really cost? Well, you know, son, a horse, it doesn't cost all that much. You gotta have a saddle and you gotta have a bridle and you gotta have a blanket too. Every once in a while that horse he just might throw a shoe. So a horse just might cost a little bit more than you thought is going to. But with all that fun, what else are you gonna do? Well, we got a horse and yeah, it was a whole lot of fun. But after a while you get tired of riding by yourself and you think I might want to invite a friend to ride along and gonna need another horse and gotta have a saddle and you gotta have a bridle and you gotta have a blanket too. Every once in a while that horse he just might throw a shoe. So a horse just might cost a little bit more than you thought is going to. But with all that fun, what else you gonna do? got a couple horses and after a while we got tired of riding around the place there and got to thinking might want to go to a rodeo or a horse show or something like that and gonna need a truck and you're gonna need a trailer because the car it just won't do sack of grain and a bale of hay because you gotta feed them too so a horse just might cost a little bit more than you thought is going to but with all that else you gonna do? Bet you call a vet cause you're gonna need a shot or two. Better get a rake and you better get a shovel to scoop up that. So a horse just might cost a little bit more than you thought is going to. But with all that fun, what else you gonna do? Well after a while you start accumulating these horses. The words accumulate. And it gets too doggone expensive to keep them in town, so about the only other thing you can do is go out and buy a ranch. Well, that's what Mom and Dad did. They went out and they bought a ranch, kept it for five years, sold it, doubled their money, and retired. So you better get a saddle and you better get a bridle and you better get a blanket too. Better buy a horse so one day you can retire too. So a horse just don't cost as much as you thought it's going to. And with all that fun, I, I know what I'm going to do.